A live look this morning for you over Paycor Stadium. Dark here this morning where it will remain, even though the Bengals are playing tonight. Yeah, the light's not coming on here at home because they are in Jacksonville, Florida to take on the Jaguars for Monday Night Football. Getting excited. We did not, though, send WCPO 9 News reporter Ellie Kramer to Florida to warm up. Instead, we stuck her outside in Madeira. Just kidding, Ellie. We love you. Uh, found, though, a unique <laughs> Bengals gift made by a super fan. I can't wait to hear all about it again. Yeah, because when you're shopping for the Bengals fans in your life, yeah, you can go down the pro shop, get a jersey, or TJ Maxx is loaded with Bengals coffee mugs that nobody is buying because, you know what, the one gift you need that no one else is going to get them is this. This is the Bengals leg lamp. I'm going to tell you, the gift of the year. So exciting. I was smiling ear to ear. Westsider Matt Boylson is straightening up his pride and joy. Just makes it so much more real when you see it up on display. This Bengals leg lamp is front and center at Romaldo's in Madeira, just like it was proudly displayed in the iconic movie A Christmas Story. Right in the middle of our front room window. The idea, Matt says, all started with this. When Evan McPherson was hitting all those field goals to bring us to the Super Bowl, um, somebody had posted a meme of like Ralphie staring up at the lamp in the window, you know, and it was like Evan McPherson's leg. So in the heat of the summer okay. and the frigid winter that is so Cincinnati, Matt is out in his shed plugging away. Last year was more of a, a frantic kind of I'd be running to the thrift store trying to find lampshades and things like that. I think I'm weird too because I come in and buy like, you know, 25 pairs of socks. <laughs> so this year he bought the materials in bulk. Cost is about 125 to 150. There's real Nike cleats. There's, you know, the, the, the mannequin legs are, that can be expensive. And he has an assembly line going. Matt says he's making 50 this year and only has about a dozen left. Maybe one less now that the display model has some new ink. My wife texted me and said, hey, Kevin Huber, sign your lamp. I said, I'll be there in 20 minutes, one second. You know, I, I came running. So <laughs> it was really, really exciting. Got to meet him. And right here the lamp is in all its glory. And we were laughing with Matt, like, OK, this is the one signed by Kevin Huber, like just this, you know, kind of standing here, that meme. But also we were like, OK, now you've got to do that, like awkward Ralphie, like strokes the leg thing. And we were getting a kick out of it. A lot of Bengals players and coaches shop here. And Matt actually got the lamp here because his beautiful wife, Anna, is a seamstress. And uh, she does a lot of the work for those players and coaches as well. So this one's signed by Kevin Huber. He says uh, it's off the table. I'm not going to be selling that one. A pretty cool thing to add or to his display collection. only. Guys. Allie, what about Evan McPherson himself? Any any thoughts about an autograph? Yes, okay, and he has one signed by Evan McPherson. He says he took the lamp to an autograph signing at the outlet malls. Can you imagine him just like carrying that up and being like, can you sign this, sir? Like, I'm sure he signed Stranger Things, maybe, but uh, he's very excited about that. He wants a Joe Burrow, a Jamar Chase autograph, right. so uh, he's going to be leaving this here as long as possible in, in hopes of it's getting like that. It's like the Rockettes, Bengals style, just leg, 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 leg. <laughs> I love it, Allie. Thanks so much.